My name is Peter Fisher. I'm the Accessibility Compliance Coordinator at Arizona State University. Over 20 years ago, I was a student here at ASU, back when the ADA was just in its infancy. So it was just getting started, but the school was already pretty accessible. Today, I get to make sure that the school is completely compliant with accessibility laws and codes. And then other things that we've added, we have an accessibility standards that we take to the next level. Um, we added things like uh, accessible entrances, automatic door buttons, at bathrooms as well. Uh, plazas like we're in today um, were once streets and had curbs and, and curb ramps, but now they're open plazas that are designed for everyone to use equally. Right behind me is actually one of the most universally designed spaces on this campus. When I went to school here 20 years ago, that was a set of stairs, about four steps, and a rickety handrail. And now we have a long sloping sidewalk with a couple of benches and some planters along the way. You'd never even notice that it was designed for accessibility. The ADA mandates that all post-secondary institutions, just like ASU, are accessible for people with disabilities, all disability types. Before the ADA, people with disabilities had a difficulty with transportation, um, often coming to the classes themselves, um, and even public perception being a disabled person in school. Today we're integrating people. Everyone is invited to share the same spaces. Um, classrooms have people with and without disabilities. Um, universal design has taken over and classrooms and the facilities and the campus is designed for everyone equally.